My name is Oscar. This is my partner, Emily Hunt, and uh, we are with Engineering Chamber Orchestra. And today, uh, we are going to talk to you about Tesla Motors and why we think GameVest should consider Tesla as a new stock. So, first, a little bit of background on the company. Uh, this company was founded uh, back in 2003 by Elon Musk, who is uh, the founder of both PayPal and SpaceX, two very um, innovative companies, doing some very innovative things with them. Um, so. For our uh, roadmap for this presentation, first we're going to talk about the uh, technology and the market. So where is the best, where is the current technology right now, and um, does it have a place in the current vehicle market? Uh, Tesla's products, what do they sell, and uh, how well do they perform uh, versus its competition? And finally, uh, we're going to end up uh, in our uh, financial statements, and uh, can the company back up their products with uh, financial results? So first off, um, technology and market. So this is the um, electric vehicle market. Uh, the first entry into this market was back in 1996, the first major entry by a GM with their model um, EV1. Now this, we found that this model was uh, very poor because they had a very poor business strategy and they only ended up selling about 2,000 units. Now I say sell, but they didn't really sell these cars, they leased them out. And so there are currently no cars on the road today. And um, not only did they have a bad business strategy, but um, there was no incentive for people to buy these cars. But now we've seen in the market that there is an incentive. Um, gas prices have soared back from 1996, where the average gas price, uh, average price of gas was one dollar and thirty cents a gallon. So now they're soaring over about four dollars a gallon. So the current market right now, uh, you see up on up, up, up on the left is the Tesla Model S. Um, on, on the bottom left we have um, a major player, the Nissan Leaf. And then we have companies such as Toyota um, investing in hybrid cars, and then of course the uh, Chevy Bolt down on the right. So we know that there are there is major interest by or there is interest by major companies in this market. But where Tesla um, out, out, um, exceeds these companies is that they are investing solely in electric vehicles, whereas companies such as Toyota and, and Chevy have an interest split between gas-powered vehicles and um, electric-powered vehicles. So really, um, the main competitor between <coughs> of, of, of Tesla is not other electric cars made by these companies. It's gas-powered cars. So how how does the uh, how do Tesla cars actually stack up? So the first car that we want to look at is the, the Tesla Roadster that was released back in 2007, and uh, we're going to compare it uh, versus a, a comparable sports car, the Chevy Corvette. So um, a couple of telling uh, facts about this car. Uh, Chevy, Chevy has been making its Corvettes since back in the 50s. And uh, Tesla just came out with this car in 2007. And uh, even then, they were able to get 120 miles per gallon, equivalent versus the Chevy Corvettes, um, average of 14 to 26. And they were able to do zero to 60 seconds, zero to 60 miles per hour in 3.7 seconds, um, which matched the Chevy Corvette. That was back in 2007. Um, every, every other uh, metric was quite lower than the Corvette, actually. Um, whether it was horsepower, torque, uh, range, but especially price. It was $105,000 versus the she this particular she Chevy Corvette, $60,000. Fast forward to today, they've made significant strides in uh, some of these fields. So down here on the left, you see the, the Tesla Model S, which has a horsepower of 420 versus this Mercedes S CLS class of 402. They um, have the exact same torque of 443 foot-pounds. The Model S does 0 to 60 in 3.9 versus the CLS is 5.1 seconds. And um, what's also very telling is the decrease in price, and not only price, but the price range. So the Model S does, uh, is sold for 87000 versus 74000 for the CLS. So we see um, a price difference drop between 45000 and $13,000. Okay, so now we're just going to talk more about the money side of it. Um, the current stock price of Tesla is $37.04 per share. And according, according to the Tesla 10K annual report that was filed in um, 2012, the company's revenues have been increasing significantly, as well as the gross profit. Um, and here is the PE values for the company. Um, you can see that there is a huge negative value and the estimates for 2013. We suspect that this is because uh, the company is investing in products that they will sell in the future 
So we've seen this in the past. Uh, they invested in a very expensive roadster, and they were able to reinvest in uh, uh, the Model S. And so we expect them to do that in the future. And the risks um, involved. Five minutes. You guys had 20 more seconds. What would you say? <laughs> <laughs> I guess um, I would summarize what we had just said um, with these three points that they have a very strong potential for growth. So they've only come out with two different models of cars the Roadster and the Model S. And with each model, we see that they're reinvesting in their products. So they, they have a very strong confidence within their product. Um, they have a very competitive product, as we've seen. Their very first run was able to, to, to compete on a few key, key factors versus uh, sports cars.